So, my Rode microphone just arrived. Let's unbox it. I never know how to get a good angle for these sort of things. So yeah, let's just unbox it. I'll give a little unboxing knife. Wait, where it is? Covering this little bit of plastic. And this little bit here. So when you open up a box, you get the furry wind cover and the mic itself. So this is the actual microphone. When you put this on it when it's windy to stop the wind from getting in, which will be really good. No clip here to attach it to your phone, but but anyway, let's do a mag test. So this is what it sounds like without the Rode microphone, and this is how the mic sounds with the microphone. As you can hear, it sounds a lot more focused on my voice and not on like the sounds around me. I'm guessing there won't be as big of a difference when you're outside because there won't be as much outside noise. But when I'm outside, you'll only really be able to hear my voice, which is what I want. So as you can see now, I've got the mini version in case you're nice that's vlogging set up. The iPhone version. So, I've run into a problem. I thought I'd be able to film my dad's for some reason, but obviously I can't because I can't edit or upload from there. So, I'm going to have to rather do a filler in vlog now. I'll film my phone, edit it on my iPad when I get there and upload it tomorrow. It won't be up late because I already have a video going up today, but I don't know. I'll, I don't know. I'll try to figure it out. So I think I'm going to film everything and edit it on my iPad. Uh, hopefully I can make it look good. I think I can. By the way, I'm using my front camera right now, but it's just a lot easier for these type of shots. I can't do it before when my microphone's broken on my phone, but now I've got this new one, I can just do it. So I'm guessing I'm going to have to bring my M50s with me because I, the iPad speakers aren't very good for editing and monitoring audio. I'd say the only problem with this microphone is you can't watch back the videos while the microphone's plugged in because you use the headphone port. So it thinks it's got headphones plugged in but it doesn't. So you have to unplug it and replug it every time you want to watch one of the videos that you filmed which is very annoying. Yeah I don't know how this vlog's going to turn out because the iOS version of iMovie is nowhere near like an equivalent of Premiere Pro obviously. Yeah this microphone will be especially good on my iPad because the microphone on there is actually terrible. So I can't use a phone case with this, so that has turned out to be quite a big problem. Just having to take off my case and then take out the microphone every time I watch it. It does seem like a bit of a hassle, but I'm sure I'll figure out a better system. Okay, I'm at 97 subscribers, really getting close to 100 right now. Try to say a clan tag, just put Ike, and it's banned. That's ridiculous. So I'm about to set off to my dad's now, and yeah, I really do hope I can find a way to get the footage onto my iPad without internet. So usually when I say I don't think I've shot a lot, I've shot about three minutes, which is about average. But I honestly do not think I've shot a lot today, so I'm going to end it with another time lapse.